Hey y'all, how are you? Uh, it's Chris Weston from Mossy Oak and uh, I wanted to show you guys something amazing. Uh, this is the Oz Chamber 8K Oz 500 combo bag from Scentlock and it is amazing. Um, the thing is, uh, I think 32 inches by 16 inches by 16 inches, somewhere in that neighborhood. Uh, there's a couple of different versions of this bag. Um, uh, I got the one with the wheels on it, and I'm pointing at the wrong end. The wheels on it and the handle, uh, but there, it's a really amazing bag. Uh, I believe the MSRP on it is about $200 on the Scentlock website. Um, but I wanted to show you guys, I was just in the house fixing to unload this thing uh, it's been sitting in there for weeks now uh, after the end of turkey season uh, I used it to go up to Triple O Outfitters in Indiana which I had an amazing turkey hunt up there so if you're interested in big deer or monster turkeys please go to the Old Oak Outfitters or Triple O Outfitters website and look those guys up for some incredible uh, hunt. So I think they've got 12,000 acres up there. But I digress. Uh, the reason we're here today is to talk about this bag. Uh, and like I said, I was just about to unload the thing and start hang putting stuff on hangers and uh, put them in my hunting closet inside the house. Uh, and I figured I would bring it, bring it outside and do a quick review for y'all. Um, but let me open this thing up first of all and show you what I've got inside here. I think you'll be amazed at the amount of clothes that it will hold. Okay, so now y'all may want to even count these jackets. I don't know, and pants, but... Uh, There's a heavy um, scent blocker wool text jacket. Or I should say vest. Uh, here is another uh, scent blocker wool text jacket. Um, merino wool jacket. Really heavy um, Mossy Oak original bottom lamp vest here. Scent blocker knockout jacket. Mossy Oak rain jacket. This is the Scent Lock. Savannah jacket. Scent blocker uh, Wooltex parka. Scent lock Savannah rain uh, jacket. Scentlock Headhunter Storm Jacket. Scentlock Recon Thermal Jacket. Scent Blocker Sherpa Vest. Uh, this is the Scent Blocker. Angatech pants, which are amazing. Uh, I did a short review on these recently. Uh, these are very lightweight, early season bow or turkey um, hunting clothes. Just amazing, really well made, durable, lightweight, very cool, um, good stuff. That scent blocker Angatech, but that's a pair of pants. Uh, 
We have a Scentlock Hardcore pair of <clears throat> rain pants, which, and these things are really thick and heavy. Scentlock Savannah uh, Arrow, I think, pants. Another pair of Scentlock pants. These are the Headhunter Storm pants, I think. Uh, Scentlock uh, Recon thermal, thermal Pants and Mossy Oak Original Bottomland. Scent Blocker Knockout Pants in New Bottomland. Uh, what is this? Looks like scent blocker um, Wooltex pants, which these things are incredible. Really, really well made. Uh, great pants. Looks like scent lock Savannah Rain pants here. Some Mossy Oak NWTF uh, Obsession pants. Looks like a set lock Oz hat and then some underwear. Um, but y'all can see that this is just a ton of stuff and this is just the jackets here. Let me see if I can show y'all the front of this four wheeler. It's just, I mean, absolutely covered up with stuff now. Um, but moving on to the bag itself, um, it is just huge. It is gigantic. And honestly, this video is never going to do justice to how big this, this bag is or how much stuff you can put inside of it. But the best part of this thing is this right here. Inside of the bag is this little pouch. And this magic box right here. This is the Oz 500, uh, <clears throat> forgive me, the Oz 500 uh, ozone machine. And uh, it's got a uh, outlet right here to plug it in. You can plug it into your car lighter. You can plug it in, which it comes with a with a uh, 12 volt thing for your car, uh, or your truck, um, or you can plug it into a wall outlet. It comes in comes with a wall outlet as well. Um, on this side, you can see this is the tube that the ozone comes out of the machine, and it actually hooks up to tubes that are uh, designed into the bag uh, and they these tubes I'll see if I can show you one uh, but these tubes look just like this and uh, they it comes to a split and those things run around the inside of the bag with different openings for the ozone to fill up and cleanse uh, the clothes that are inside of the bag. Now, the great thing, the thing that's really, I think, unique about this bag is uh, you can use it, of course, for a traditional, uh, you know, bag to put your hunting clothes in to keep them, to keep, you know, that ozone will cleanse and it destroys pathogens on a molecular level, really um, uh, changing the, the composition uh, on a molecular level of these pathogens, germs, bacteria, uh, fungus, uh, viruses, uh, and, and that kind of thing. So it's a very, very effective uh, way to, uh, you know, destroy the odor-causing germs uh, that would uh, give you a bigger, a larger scent cone when you're hunting in the woods. So, of course, you can use your hunting clothes for that, which I do. 
Um, but another fantastic use uh, for this thing is uh, that you can go to the grocery store and you walk right out of the grocery store and you put your grocery bags inside of here and you zip it up and you run this ozone uh, on your way home and what you're doing is you're eliminating uh, a lot of these germs that that may cause you to get sick and uh, and in uh, today's environment where we have a global pandemic sweeping the world right now uh, that has affected millions of people and it has uh, you know really brought uh, the world's economies uh, to a screeching halt uh, you cannot be too careful about picking up germs you can go to the grocery store put your grocery bags in here zip it up run the ozone on the way home or if you go to the hardware store, same thing applies. Throw everything in here, zip it up, uh, and then uh, you can cleanse, literally wash the packaging, wash the packages themselves, and the products that you are buying at the store, uh, you can wash them on your way home, and you can uh, really feel confident that when you are unloading your groceries or you're unloading these items that you've gotten at the grocery store, at the, uh, forgive me, hardware store or wherever, that you are not infecting, uh, reinfecting yourself with germs that you've picked up in the grocery store. You know, I mean, who knows what goes on in the store? I mean, somebody may be sick and they're sneezing all over or their hands or the products that they've been looking at in the store and they did not end up buying and then you come along a few minutes later and pick those products up, then who knows what you're going home with. Uh, so, you know, again, still you need to wear your face mask, wear gloves, uh, and, and go and wash your hands all the time. Uh, but, uh, so I'm not saying uh, not to do those things that you have been doing. Uh, we lost, I think we're having a problem with the focus. Uh, but, so I'm not saying, uh, to stop doing common sense things, but I am saying that this can be a very, very effective tool uh, in uh, a really uh, frightening world that we live in today. Um, Y'all, thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope you're having a wonderful day, uh, and God bless you. And uh, please, uh, if you liked the video, if you thought that it was a good review, uh, uh, go ahead and uh, uh, yeah, share it and like it uh, and then oh before I go I should show you too the uh, handle comes out so it's a roller bag uh, there's wheels on the other end of it uh, it comes with a shoulder strap and then of course there's uh, you know your traditional handles and stuff too but hey thank you guys so much for watching this uh, this this video I'm going to uh, post a link to this product that will take you directly to the Scentlock website in case you wanted to order one for yourself. But again, uh, I hope you guys have a great day and God bless. Bye-bye.